So Darren, right now in our marketplace, we're struggling with uh, affordability. Yes. Because things have appreciated so quick and the cost of building is so high with the cost of land and construction and all that stuff. So much demand. That's right. There's yeah. a ton of demand, a ton of buyers out there looking and they're struggling to find houses that are going to fit. And so I thought this one would be a great fit because it's just under that $300,000 price range. Yes, that's a great price range. Yeah. And these, these houses fly off the shelves because you've got everything all finished out. You've got your yard in, you've got your fence in. You've got the basement finished, and and they and it's it's decked out. Yeah, a lot of people don't understand when they build a new house how much money it takes to get the yard and the fence and all those things. Thousands of dollars. Yes, uh, I mean we figure figure a basement uh, if you do it yourself is about twenty dollars a square foot to finish out. Yeah, and that adds up really quickly. Really into fast. Thousands of dollars. And so a property like this, under $300,000, you've got your nice kitchen, your granite countertops, your, your hardwood floors. I mean, it's beautiful. Yeah. Uh, and, and this is what people are looking for. So this one we expect will sell very, very quickly. I imagine so, yeah. yeah. A lot of house for the money. Yeah, and so talk about financing and, and what that would look like on a property like this. Well, the great thing about a home like this is there are a lot of financing options for it because of its price range and its mm -hmm. location. So you could have FHA, uh, VA loans, conventional loans. Uh, you know, you would, could possibly even do a Utah Housing Zero Down loan on this, depending on which one you choose. Uh, but there's just a lot of options, and so it really opens up the market for who could buy this house, which yeah. is why they're so hot. Yeah, and so your rent, theoretically, uh, rent would be, it would cost you more to rent a property like this than to own it. Yeah, it's very likely. Yeah, and mm -hmm. then you get the appreciation of it, and I mean, look at that, you get a separate tub and shower, yes. lots of windows, which I really like in this property. I love that. It's this is down in the basement, which is really, look at how much win uh, light's coming in, in the those windows. Wonderful. I mean, it's almost a daylight basement. It really is. Uh, and it levels out. It's not like the, the backyard slopes down either. It, it, it kind of slopes down to the side, so the side yard comes down, and then it levels out flat on the backyard. So it's flat in the front yard and flat in the backyard and just kind of levels down perfectly. So they got a really good lot for this one. Yeah. And so at that $300,000 range, I mean, this is a lot of house for the money. This is a type of house that, you know, appreciates well because it's always so desirable. It's kind of not your entry level home. It's a step above an entry level Correct. home. Correct. Mm -hmm. uh, but it's still got the modern styling and everything that's going on. Look at that. They did their own little uh, um, shower in there. Lots of room for expansion. Look at the view off their back deck. You can watch the fireworks and everything. You've got your, your little storage shed in the backyard. I love that shed. Yeah, that's nice, huh? Yep. This one even has an RV pad, it appears. Yeah. Yeah. They've, they've got it all situated really well, so this one's going to sell real quick. Great home.